Hi everyone, I'm Jennifer from English with Jennifer. Let's study basic English together. Subscribe and watch all of my lessons. You can study with my students Flavia and Andrea. Do you enjoy the weekend? I think we all do. It's a time to relax, a time to do some housework, and a chance to go out and have fun. I'm going to talk about weekend plans with Flavia and Andrea. Listen. All right, so we've practiced will for the future. There are more ways to talk about the future, right? especially with plans. Mm -hmm. If I want to know your plans for the weekend, what can I ask? Do you know? Um. <laughs> Where are we? Where are? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> so, so often we ask, "What are you doing this weekend? Do you have plans? What are you doing? What are you doing?" What are you doing this weekend? Do you have any plans? Mm -hmm. These are common questions. Have is right now. I, I have plans for the weekend. Do you have any plans? Do you have any plans? That's why we use the present tense. Right now, do you have plans for the weekend? Mm -hmm. So I could ask, do you have any plans? Do you have any plans for the weekend? Try asking this question first. Do you have any plans? Do you have any plans? Do you have any plans for the weekend? Do you have any plans for the weekend? Uh -huh. Do you have any plans? Do you have any plans? Do you have any plans for the weekend? Do you have any plans for the weekend? Yeah. Do you have any plans for the weekend? No. No. <laughs> no. Not yet. Not, oh yeah. Not yet. Oh, nothing special. Yeah. Those are typical answers. Mm, not yet. <laughs> no. Um, nothing special. Nothing special. Like I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you have any plans for the weekend? Not yet. Not <laughs> yet. <laughs> so I'm still thinking about today. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't know. We can also ask, what are you doing this weekend? What are you doing this weekend? This is the present. Mm -hmm. Present progressive. We can use the present progressive for the future. What are you doing this weekend? I'm staying home. Mm -hmm. right. I need to clean the house. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> I'm, I'm staying home. Oh, okay. When you answer, if you're thinking about your plans, because I don't know, and then you begin to think, you can use will. Oh, I don't know. Um, I'll be home all weekend. I'll probably do laundry. I'll clean. Mm -hmm. I'll watch some TV. I'm thinking and making plans. You can use will. Right? So if you don't know yet, you can start to think and use will. Like, hmm, I'll do this, I'll do that, maybe I'll do this, maybe I'll do that. Right? So think of one plan right now. What will you do? If I ask you, what are you doing this weekend? I don't know. What are you doing this weekend? And now make a plan with will. Maybe I'll do laundry. Maybe I I I will clean. I'll my clean. House. I'll yeah. probably clean. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I I'll I'll probably prob probably <laughs> probably clean my house. Yeah. yeah. I'll clean. I say I think I'll clean. I think I'll, I'll clean, clean the house. I think, I think I'll. I think I will clean the I house. I think I will clean the house. Mm -hmm. wow. What are you doing this weekend? I think I clean <laughs> the house yeah. and uh, 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 I will uh, cooking. I'll cook. Cooking. I I will I will I will walking the beach. Not I'll walking, I'll walk. I'll walk. 
I'll walk, walk on the beach. beach. I'll take a walk. So you're thinking, it's like, I don't know, but I'll clean. I'll, I'll do laundry. Maybe I'll take a walk on the beach. Mm -hmm. right? We're thinking right now and we're making our plans and we can use will. Mm -hmm. If you know your plans, we can use be going to. No plan. You know, be going to. This is all plans already made. Mm. I'm not thinking, I know. Mm -hmm. So if you ask me, what are you doing this weekend? Oh, I'm going to see my brother and we're going to have dinner together and I'm going to have a picnic in the park. Mm -hmm. I know. Mm -hmm. I've already, I have plans. Mm -hmm. I know what I'm doing. I'm going to see my brother. I'm going to have a picnic. Right. We can use be going to for our future plans tonight, tomorrow, this weekend, next week. Be going to. Mm -hmm. Okay. Repeat after me. Let's use the simple present and present progressive. Do you have plans? Do you have any plans? Do you have plans for the weekend? What are you doing this weekend? Repeat after me. Let's use will. I don't know. Maybe I'll go to the beach. I'm not sure yet. Maybe I'll just stay home. So for future plans, we have be going to plus a verb. For example, let's say tonight, tomorrow, or next week, I'm going to visit a friend. So we have a form of be, am, are, is, mm -hmm. right? I am going to visit. I'm going to visit a friend. Maybe tonight, I already know. I know we're going to see a movie. The verbs are be going to. What do you hear? Something different. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Slow and careful speech. I'm going to visit. What you're going to hear often is gonna, mm -hmm. gonna. Mm -hmm. I'm going to visit a friend. I'm, I'm gonna. gonna. I'm going to visit, I'm going to visit a friend. Mm -hmm. We're going to see a movie, we're going to see. Mm -hmm. That's what you'll hear. So say it slowly and carefully with me. I'm going to visit a friend. 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 I'm gonna visit a friend. I'm gonna visit a friend. We're going to see a movie. We're going to see a movie. We're gonna see a movie. We're gonna see a movie. We're going to see a movie. We're going to see a movie. We're gonna see a movie. We're gonna see a movie. 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 Uh-huh. But you'll also hear going to become going. Sometimes I say not gonna, but going. I'm going going to. Going, going to, to going, going to, to going, going to, to going going going, going, to. going to I'm going to visit a friend I'm going to visit a friend we're going, going to see a movie we're going to we're see, going a to see a movie. we're going to so you will hear variation mm -hmm. I'm going to I'm going to I'm gonna mm -hmm. we're going to we're going to we're gonna mm -hmm. you'll hear different pronunciations mm -hmm. of these verbs Right? Mm -hmm. Very often in the fast speech and relaxed speech you'll hear gonna. Gonna does not sound very nice when you're speaking slowly. We're gonna visit it. <laughs> <Does that? laughs> We're gonna visit. We're gonna visit. We're gonna see. It sounds better in faster speech. <laughs> okay. The question, are you going to do something? Are you going to see a movie? Are you going to visit a friend? Again, you'll have variation. Are you going to visit? Are you going to visit? Are you going to visit? Mm -hmm. right. So you, right now, don't try to rush too fast. Let's use going to. Are you going to see a movie? Mm -hmm. Are you going to see a movie? Let's practice asking each other questions. 
I'll go first and I'll ask Flavia. Mm -hmm. We're talking about this weekend. Are you going to wake up early? This weekend? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> but I'm not going, I'm not going, going to, to wake up wake it early. early. Okay. You can ask Andrea a question. Are you going to clean your apartment this weekend? Yes, I'm going to clean my house. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Yeah. Right, and the full answer is yes, I'm going to clean my house. Or yes, I am. Yes, I am. You can mm -hmm. do long, you can do short. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, I am. Mm -hmm. right. You can ask me a question. Are you going to stay up late? Yes, I'm going to stay up late. I usually stay up every late all the time, so I'm going to stay up late tonight, I'm going to stay up late on Saturday. Yeah, I'm going to stay up late. I'm going to, I'm going to I'm stay going, up late. Are you going to sleep in tomorrow morning? Sleep in. Sleep in. Sleep in is sleep for a long time. Like 10, 11, because I know usually you wake up early. You have to go to school. But on the weekends you don't have to. Right. Mm -hmm. So my question is, are you going to sleep mm -hmm. in tomorrow morning? Uh, yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Are you going to call your family this weekend? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'm going to to call my mom. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. Are you going to study this weekend? Yes, I am. I need to <laughs> because the next week we have yes. you have test. Next week we'll have mm -hmm, next week. Um, you could say next week we have I a test. Know. It can because a test is a schedule. You can say next week we have a test. Next week you we have. I, you can say we have. It's present. It's okay. Next week we have a test. Next week I have a test. Oh, I'm go going to. You can, but because a test is on a schedule, mm -hmm. the teacher's schedule, the school schedule, you mm. can use have. Have. Next week I have a test. Next week I have a test. Okay. Next week. Whose turn? Is it your turn? Uh, are you going to do laundry? Oh yes, I'm going to do a lot of laundry. <laughs> um, I always do uh, a lot of laundry on Saturday. Yeah. And I do. Yeah, I do some laundry on Sunday too. I'm going to do a lot of laundry tomorrow morning. Yeah, unfortunately. Um, are you going to go to the gym tonight? Tonight? Yes. Yeah? Are yeah. you going to go to the gym tomorrow? Tomorrow. No. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But you're going tonight. That's yeah. Good. <laughs> um, are you going to visit a museum this weekend? No, no, I'm not. Yeah. No, I'm not. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not. Are you going to watch TV? Yes, I think I'll. I think I'll watch a little TV tonight. Mm -hmm. And same so thing. I think I haven't made the plan. I'm thinking. But mm -hmm. Yeah, I. I, th I think I'll watch some TV tonight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So there's a difference. Often it's okay to use will or be going to mm -hmm. for your plans, but usually when we're thinking about our plans, we mm -hmm. use will. Mm -hmm. I think maybe I'll watch some TV tonight. Mm -hmm. But with the gym, she's going tonight. She knows. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right? She's, mm -hmm. she's, she's going to go to the gym tonight because mm -hmm. right? she always goes on Fridays, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> Repeat after me. Let's use go and be going to. Are you going out? Are you going to the movies? Are you going to visit your friend? Are you going to study all weekend? Let's repeat those last two questions. We'll speak faster and we'll use gonna. Are you gonna visit your friend? Are you gonna study all weekend? Good. Let's practice more with be going to. Listen. We had Little Red Riding Hood and Goldilocks. Goldilocks, Goldilocks and the Three Bears. 
Goldilocks and the Three Bears. So, and Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Oops. All right. Um, there's a little girl, mm -hmm. and she's in the woods, and there's a bear family. Mm -hmm. And the bear family has a little problem with the cereal. Do you remember? Uh, the cereal is... The cereal is uh, too hot. It's too hot. It's too hot. Right. So what are they going to do? They are going to... What? Leave. No, leave. And leave. they're going to... Walk. No? Take a walk. Take a walk. They're going to take a walk in the woods. And then they're walking in the woods and little red rock with little Goldilocks. Goldilocks. <laughs> Goldilocks is going to come. And what is she going to do? She try she she's going she's to, going to try a, a big bed, small bed, mm -hmm. medium bed, and try she's going to try a shares and hot hot cereals yeah yeah i think first she's going to try the cereal then she's mm -hmm. going to try the chairs mm -hmm. and then she's our, then she'll, <laughs> she'll get tired all right yes. then she's going to go upstairs and uh, the sleep yeah she's going to sleep she's right. going to sleep she's going to sleep and we know what happens next good family is going to house come home come home mm -hmm. And find her mm -hmm. and the. Uh, uh, I'm not sure what's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I think um, I I know they're going to be upset, and then I think mm -hmm. look Goldilocks. She is go, going to run away. I think she's going to run away. Yeah. yeah, I think that's the way it goes. <laughs> okay. That's all for now. I hope the lesson was useful. Please like and share the video with others learning English. As always, thanks for watching and happy studies. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Check out my videos on Instagram. And don't forget to subscribe.